you guys are getting ready to play your first tournament of the year. What are yes. your thoughts uh, going into the tournament? Excited. Um, we had our scrimmage with Lynn today, and we saw a lot of good things. You know, we actually got to play against an opponent other than ourselves, and got to see a very good opponent. You know, Lynn's a very solid Division Two program, and you know, pushed us a little bit, pushed us out of our comfort zone, but showed what we can do and uh, where we can go, which is very exciting. What do you, uh, what do you, what do you think the positives of the team right now going into the tournament? What do you think are the strengths right now that you have going in? Uh, as strengths, it's it's still a little bit unknown about our strengths because with, with twelve new players and only four returning players, um, just the excitement. Uh, team chemistry is very good. Uh, the girls have been practicing very well for two and a half weeks. Uh, they've been working their tails off uh, in the weight room uh, and on the court. And just getting ready to uh, leave tomorrow, it's going to be fun. It's going to be a long road trip tomorrow, but, you know, I think the girls are excited. You know, just the way we were able to play and compete against Lynn today, you know, I think up the uh, ante and the excitement. Um, and just to get ready on the court for that 9 a.m. match against Concordia, Nebraska. Mm -hmm. Now, looking at last year, we, there was a couple of tournaments. This year we see a few more especially now early on starting the season with a tournament, what do you feel the benefits are kicking the year off with a kind of tournament and seeing a lot of different opponents? Well, and, and that's what we want to do every year is we want to have, you know, three to four tournaments, um, you know, under our belts, at least two to three before we start conference play because, you know, it gives us time to, you know, see where we are, see what we're doing. We're facing teams that normally we won't face. Um, how often are we going to see Concordia, Nebraska? Mm -hmm. or teams from Michigan that are coming down in our tournament in uh, two weeks. Uh, it gives us, you know, as we get into, you know, the season, it just gives us that much more experience um, to get ready for ultimately is, uh, the conference met, you know, our conference. And, you know, this year we'll have, I think, 15 matches played before we play our first conference match, where last year I think we only had one or two matches in. Mm -hmm. And, you know, after 15 matches we'll know exactly where we are and, um, where we can go with this year. Now, uh, the preseason poll came out last week. Um, we saw that the Seahawks were sixth. What are your thoughts on that? I think we're too high. Yeah. I know. It's, I, I'd be curious to see what the other coaches are thinking. You know, um, Obviously, they see the press releases. We got 12 new players, but with four returning players, we finished seventh in the conference last year. Um, you know, it's, you know I, I figured we'd be around six or seven. Um, which is fine for us. You know, we want to be the underdogs this year. We want to be the unknown um, and just, you know, playing all these tournaments and just getting us ready for conference and, um, you know, the girls take it as a challenge. Going into the tournament, back to that, yes. what, are the ben what do you want to get out of the tournament? What would you like to see overall, you know, after Friday and Saturday's matches, what do you, you know, want to have it's, happen? I think we'll see what our team is made of. Um, you know, in this first tournament, you know, the, the work that we've done the last two and a weeks, the, is that paying off? Um, you know, you know, obviously we want to get some wins and I think we can, you know, we got to go out and play and, you know, starting 9 a.m. on uh, Friday, it's, you know, we'll know pretty early where we are and what we can do. And, um, you know, this first tournament, you know, can set the tone for what we want to do this year. And, you know, we've set our team goals and, I'm not going to tell you our team goals because that's, you know, part of our team. But, you know, I think what we do this weekend can really go in a long way in determining how we achieve our team goals. Mm -hmm. Do you feel a competition you play will definitely set you up for success moving into the conference? Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, we're going to play teams, you know, from out of our region. And, you know, see teams, you know, obviously we're going to see a team from Nebraska, uh, Shawnee State, Montreat, North Carolina, Coastal Georgia, you know, teams that we wouldn't see until, you know, we would make the uh, NAIA tournament. That's what, you know, we're building up to is, you know, to get to that level. And, you know, Montreat's going to be a good test. they got a solid program. Coastal Georgia's, I've looked at their, you know, stats, and they had a good year last year. Um, so, it, you know, we're going to see some tough competition, and it's, it's going to see, okay, here's where we are, and it's, it's not going to make or break our year for, sh for you know, for sure but it's going to let us know where we are and where we need to go and what we need to do to get there.